Welcome back one and all to Trails of Cold Steel. I am the Dark Seraph. Last time we were doing some preparation for the school festival. Supposedly we have more prep to do today before the concert. Okay, Laura can play drums apparently. Stories coming to a wrap. Meanwhile, preparations for the festival continued steadily around the student council president Toa's watchful eye. Um, it's like a garden of some kind, a maze maybe? I don't know. A castle look for this club's room. Cards? Yeah, it looks like Blade. Looks like they're going for a luau look with this one. Maybe a mount. No, that was definitely an Eastern Asian style post. Giant whack-a-mole. Patrick High Arms and Ferris. That was perfection itself. Indeed, victory is as good as ours. I cannot stand you. Meanwhile, our rivals and other classes put the finishing touches on their own contributions to the festival. However, Principal Van Dyke. Ho ho ho! It looks like this year's festival will be even livelier than last year's. An ill wind blows from the east and ominous clouds still hanging over our fair country. But young people have their whole future ahead of them. They ought to pursue their dreams with excitement with passion. Just as they always have as they will likely always will. I agree. It's good to be young. Even His Highness was in that foolish Osborne for boys once. Indeed. There's Sarah. I'm back from my patrol. Thank you, Sarah. It looks like everything will be finished by the end of the day. Instructor Beatrix, my apologies, I have no idea you were here. <sighs> you really don't need all that formality, or the salute for that matter. You've accomplished more than enough since we first met to stand proudly on equal footing with me. But you saved my life. Kinda hard to trump that. And if you weren't for you, I wouldn't have the opportunity to join the guild either. Oh! Interesting. <laughs> it's hard to believe it's been ten years since then. My, how time flies. You're quite the popular figure on campus. Weren't you Nightheart Superior at one point? Sorry, silence, I had to get a drink. I'm worried what will become of this academy in the next year. So am I. Have you heard anything from Major Nightheart yet? I don't think the Imperial Liberation Front is dead. C doesn't look the type of person to go out like a bitch. He definitely seems the person to die in combat. Besides, we never learned who he 
was. getting interesting. Well, it's been interesting from since the very beginning. <sighs> yeah, we did it! That was our best yet. I feel like we were really giving everything we had with that one. Ah, oh, I need a rest. The only question now is whether we can do that in front of a hall full of people. Don't worry, we'll be fine. We prepared as much as we can. It's all in the goddess's hands now. <laughs> Maybe you're right. But when you put it that way, it sounds like no matter how much work we put in, it all comes down to luck in the end. If that's the case, we'll just have to coerce luck into staying on our side. <laughs> nice work, guys. I think we're right where we want to be. You play like you did just now for the actual concert, and we'll be golden. Thanks for all your help, Crawl. I noticed his headband changed to match his jacket. I like that. If you're satisfied, I think our audience will be too. <sighs> what time is it even? Uh, currently, as I'm recording this, 5.25 on July 3rd, uh, 23rd. Only 3 p.m. Wow, I thought it was evening already. <laughs> well, no one could accuse us of not being focused enough. I just want to go back to the dormitory and bury my face in my pillow. Rest? Oh, no, 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 no. No time for that now. See, the best concerts always have two aces in the hole. An unexpected surprise and an encore. Now that we've finally got the basics down, we can try pulling off something that'll pave our road to victory. What? Surprises? An encore? What? Please, tell me you're just kidding. You are, right? Wait, we're not seriously doing that. I thought you were just joking. Now, hold on just a minute. You aren't seriously suggesting that we add another song, are you? Ding, ding! He can be taught! <laughs> I like Crow. Don't worry your pretty little heads, though. As soon as you hear what I've got in mind, you'll be all in on this. I've got a nice, simple <laughs> tune in mind that everyone's heard. And most people probably even know the lyrics. Anyway, we haven't got much time <laughs> to practice, intense. so how about we get right down to business? To defeat the Huns? Uh, you're a slave driver. Uh... <laughs> Poor Emma. Ah, you killed her! <laughs> Hang in there, Emma. Uh, I think Crow is more fired up about this than anyone else, even me. He's taking us on a ride one way or another, so we might as well just strap ourselves in. Still hard at work, I see. Oh, George. Sounds like you've managed to finish the difficult stuff, huh? Yep, it wasn't easy. But I think it'll be worth it in the end. This year's festival is shaping up to be even more fun than last year's. Really? You're worried about Angie, aren't you? I'm sure she'll come through for us. But with what's been happening in Crossville right now, all the terrorist attacks in the last couple months. It sounds like this country's got some tough times ahead of it. I've started to think this maybe she might not make it. Always a possibility. But you know what? Even knowing that, I don't feel worried. 
knowing how much fun we're going to have these next two days, I can't imagine Angie missing a good party. You're right. You really do. Really do what? Never mind. Oh yeah. It looks like Class 7's still at it. I wonder if they're still practicing. I don't know. I looked in on I looked in on them this afternoon and it seemed like they were basically done. Still, I've got Crow as their producer. You know, there's always a little bit of worry in the back of my mind. Now that you mention it, whoopsie, looks like we are a little late. Green? What happened to you guys? You look exhausted. It's probably because they are. I can't believe we made it through alive. That was like torture. I'm so tired. I'm gonna call Lammy. Don't. You. Dare. Celine. Grandmother. Emma, you can't just sleep here out here. At least summon up the energy to get back to your bedroom first. Are... Are you all okay? All finished with the concert rehearsal? Just about. We were cutting it pretty close. Now, that's left to see how it goes for the audience. I'm sure we'll be fine. A wind of blessing will blow on us. Still, you look like you're all rehearsed till you dropped. Literally. You should all feel proud. I've seen how hard you've worked. That's great to hear. I can't wait to see you guys play live. Oh. Looks like they've got the decorations up now. You can feel the excitement in the air. Let's hang out in the dormitory, check up on everyone. I cannot wear... I cannot remove them. That's unfortunate. I'm going to kill you, Crow. Whoa, whoa! Don't tell me you six-time field study champs got your butts kicked by a little practice. Where's that youthful energy? You've got another year before you're an old man like me. This is mostly your fault, you know. Hey, now. I just don't want you guys to come crying to me later because I didn't push you. Though to be fair, I was just gonna leave things as they were if I didn't think you would be all kept up. But hey, you did. Just like I knew you would. Crow. Thanks. Yeah. Machias and Eusis. Listen up, Eusis. The success or failure of the guy's part depends entirely on us. So don't even think about screwing this up. Huh, you're the last person who should be reminding me of that. While you're ex exchanging advice, try not to get too overzealous on stage. We don't want you to squander all our hard work. I know perfectly well what I should and shouldn't be doing on stage. These two never change, do they? But at least they're arguing in sync. Concert should be a breeze if they can keep that up. Elliot. Pretty rough day, huh? Okay. Uh, Gaius should be in his room. Yep. 
Yeah, that's great to see her. Whenever I got to see more of Rain's power form, brief mentions of it, I'm actually tired. Partnering up with Milliam's hard work. She has a habit of just doing things. I don't like it. Roger. Oh. What did I just say? Room! This is her room right here. Monday night, I actually fell asleep on the couch I'm recording on right now. That was a long day. Anyway. Sing one of the songs. Why me of all people? Surely there, most, there must have been a better choice. I don't know. Honestly, I think Crow's decision was spot on. You do? Okay, but if you're tired, should you be practicing your form with a claymore? Jesus. You never quit. Uh, just a minute or two, yeah. Yeah, that was Fee's room. She's fixing to pass out on that couch. <clears throat> That's everyone. Well, except Sarah, who's not here. I don't feel like tracking down Sarah and Shannon, so let's get Reen right to bed and get ready for the concert. Hold up. Change in main story to advance. Yeah, that's fine. Same day, 2200 hours or 10 o'clock p.m. Oh, I'm beat. My brain's awake, but my body is exhausted. I guess at least a good night's rest will take care of the fatigue. At this point, all I can do is just pour everything I've got into the concert. Hmm. Wasn't there a music program that runs around this time? I could use something to wind down. I don't feel like reading, and there's not much else going on this late on a Friday night. Guess I'll just relax till bedtime. I know I'll be showing Elise around on the second day of the festival. So, the only day I'll be roaming around on my own is tomorrow. If I get the chance, maybe I should meet up with some of the others to see what all of the other classes are doing. Huh? Testing, testing. One, two, three. Wait, we're already live? <clears throat> Excuse me? We interrupt your regularly scheduled broadcast to bring you this special news bulletin. This afternoon, Crossbell State issued a Declaration of Independence. Yeah, they kind of did that back in August. This declaration was issued by the state government based on a recent referendum and carries no legal authority whatsoever. Yeah, neither... well, never mind. The Imperial government has issued an official statement that they refuse to accept the declaration as valid. Yeah, so did the British. And the president of the Calvert Republic, which also claims authority over the state, has made a similar statement. In spite of this, Crossbell's Mayor Croyce has declared that the country will act as an independent state going forward. 
as well as announced the establishment of the Crossbell Defense Force, raising tensions both at home and abroad. Whoa. Pull to the test. Put to the test, excuse me. The Academy Festival, day one. Students and visitors. Thank you very much for your patience. Without further ado, I hereby declare the 127th Thor's Military Academy Festival open. Enjoy yourselves today and have a wonderful time. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. I say let him be independent. two people. Okay, that sounds fun. Let's get to it. Oh, slow down there. Classu Stella Garden. Okay. Hmm. Instructor Sarah and Toa are options. I say Elisa. For shippers. Take a walk. This is neat. Just leave people to their devices. No need to intrude upon them. Wow. 
I certainly picked the right one to take Elisa on. Nice moment between them. That was nice. I assume that increased. Yep. Level five. Rush two. I think that's what it said. Yeah, rush two. Just the one I did, so there's no need to do it a second time. Vivi. One of the crazy pink haired girls. A tea house. Uh. Valora. Crazy. Ah, <laughs> uh, sure, let's go with the rousing one. Compatible with those passions you share. Build a relationship in which you complement each other's strengths while pushing one another to great heights. Mine reads, a wholehearted strength is an attractive quality, but that alone may push away potential partners. You are more than strength. Seek to improve your unique traits and wear them proudly on your sleeve. Interesting. Okay, she's worried about being seen as too masculine. I think she's just fine as she is. <laughs> she got a little flustered.
Oh, I was already at level 5 with her. So that was a waste. He's not quite at five yet. Oh, I'm supposed to go to one of the food stalls. I guess those are in here. Maybe up the stairs? Yes. Okay, Gate of Alex Blade, okay. Fee. The music from the bar. begin. We draw here, right? You're first, I guess. Guess we'd better draw again. You're first, I guess. Guess we'd better draw again. I'm first. Take this. I lost. Yeah. I won. One more. I'm terribly sorry to intrude on your fun Shannon? Sharon! Okay, I get to go against her. The Blade Master. Raw, raw, raw. Okay, here we go. <laughs> well, shall we begin? Please draw a card. Looks like I go first. I'm using a bow. I should have been more careful. I'm using a bow. Now then, how will you react to this? <laughs> so that's how you want to play. Now then, how will you react to this? Just go with what I have. Now then, how will you react to this? With victory. Splendid! A well-deserved victory! A relief card? I wonder what that does. I mean, it's just a card game.
rush to. Wonder if there's anything on the rooftop. There's still stuff, there's stuff at the gymnasium, stuff out on the field. Let's go to the field. Okay. Uh, Link. Elliot. Machius Eusis. Do it. Let's do this. Where I'm going. Damn. It didn't work. Just over. Not enough to hit it over. I got two more tickets though. Mishy Panic. Gaius, this seems like a bit of fun. Pink ones are worth more. Nope. They cost you points. Good thing they're not up for very long. 
And I guess that's Mishy's girlfriend? I don't know. That was fun. That was a fun minigame. Done everything. What else is there? Can I go have more tea? I could go back to the maze. Go back to the Blade Arena, or I can play the mini game again. Yeah, you know, I want to go back to their writing mini game. I want that. I can. I want to try again. Miraculous cut was a lot of health points. Okay. Can I actually go again? Machius to this once. How about Eusis this time? I mean, he's right there. This. Stiff controls. Da, 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 da. Of course. Not enough for a level up. The first day of the Academy Festival is nearly over. Thank you for coming today, everyone. I hope you'll join us for our second day of festivities. And for all of you prepping tonight for tomorrow's attractions, good luck. And try not to overexert yourself.
Well, that was fun. I got another day of festivities to do, though. That'll be next episode, because I've been going for 46 minutes now. Well, 45, but close enough. Now it's been 46 minutes. The time has come. What? Lisa, you were with me. I went in there one time. Emma knows what's up. It's got something to do with that schoolhouse. I'm gonna end this one here. Thank you all for watching. Join me next time on Trails of Cold Steel as I figure out what the fuck's going on at the old schoolhouse. Oh yeah, and more festival stuff. But until then, I am the Dark Seraph, signing off.